What's the haps? I'm Maroka, and today I'm going to be taking an early look at Party Hard! This is a game from Binocle Games! I, I don't know how you pronounce that, I think I may have got that right, maybe, I don't know. But I, I played this at PAX, and it was really awesome, and they've just sent me a, a version of this level to play. So, I kind of want to share this with you. So this is a game, if you're not familiar with it, about murdering people at a party because they're too noisy. God damn it. So you're gonna crush their party and you're gonna stab them all. Which is a sentiment I can get behind. I'm, I, I like this person. This person's got the right attitude. It's, it's kind of ridiculous, but it's really awesome. So we can wander around and we can go, go get stabby. Like that. Woo! Stabby. I am the person in the blue with the circle of either feet, um, if you hadn't yet noticed. Uh, so I can wander around and I can stab people. Now, I, this this version of the game, kind of limited. Oh, she's going to spot the corpse now and go, Oh no, police, there's a dead person. Yeah. I'll just have a, I'll just have a bit of a boogie. See, I'm just dancing. Woo! Dancing. It wasn't me, I didn't murder anyone, I'm just dancing. Woo! Yeah, you can you, you can blend in with the crowd by dancing. It's awesome. I love it. I don't know, it's a really, really simple kind of concept. It's just kill everybody in the room. But there's something really compelling and kind of addictive about trying to murder everybody without getting caught. Because you can get caught, and I probably will get caught, but nonetheless. It's sort of semi-procedural in that you'll get different people in different places each time. These guys at this end, like there's a guy passed out on the couch, another one puking over the balcony. Uh, they, they won't be there next time if I come back to this level and do it again. Probably will do it again. Uh, they won't be there, so that varies. Uh, I wish these people would get out of my room because I need, I, need, I need to get stabby around here. If Bunny Face and Yellow Shirt can get out of here, I can stab the fat dude. Oh, maybe I can stab Bunny Face. Go on. Oh, you out of here. I need to, I need to stab and... You on the couch? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Three dead. Woo! Murder. Now they... No, no, no. I'm about to die. I'm not gonna press my luck by trying to murder them. Oh no, he's calling the cops. Wasn't me, I was over here by the bar the whole time having a bit of a dance. Woo! This is it. Uh, there, are, there are things to interact with. There are, well, there will be. The level I played at PAX had a bunch of stuff, and there is a Game Jam demo out there, original Game Jam version, which has got some stuff that you can interact with in the level, and you can play that, and maybe you kind of, uh, one of the things is you can, like, tamper with the stove, so the gases, so it's leaking gas, so when someone goes near it, it explodes. Uh, there's a bunch of stuff you can like push a tree through a window and crush whoever's on the other side. It's kind of crazy. Uh, this level actually doesn't seem to have any of that yet. It's a little disappointing because that's kind of some of those are the more interesting ways to kill people. In this, it's just getting stabby. Although I will say, if we have a wander over here, I might be able to make good use of it. Um, you people, go away. Hang on, I need to, I need to murder one of the two of you before I go. Come on. Uh, if I hold right trigger, there's kind of a suspicion meter. I don't know. I guess that means how much they suspect me. Okay, I'll murder the waiter. Oh, he's get Yeah, boom. Stabbed. Get stabbed. They seem to have a fairly limited range of what they can see. Look, I'm up on a balcony kind of thing. You'd have thought those guys down there would have been able to see me, actually, but... Nope. I'm kind of glad they can't. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go through here. Woo! What a slide. See, I can, I can leave the scene of the crime via the swimming pool. I love it. Hi, she's not spotted the corpse there. Uh, I'm kind of, I kind of want to go stab her now. She's, she's, oh no, 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 there's a green guy coming down there. Well, you can get stabbed. I've hidden his body under the water slide. Nobody will ever know. I mean, I'm just dancing. Just dancing. So yeah, uh, the water slide seems to be like the only thing that you can actually interact with. I'm not going to wander over there because he's going to spot that corpse. And yeah, I, I would be super suspicious to be hanging around there. The police can get the wrong people and they can arrest the wrong people, which is always satisfying. It's like, yeah, you, you just take that guy away from me. The object clearly just being to shut down the party by either having everybody killed or arrested. It's, like I say, it's, it's very, very silly but entertaining and it's really hard. It's really, really astonishingly hard to actually get everything complete one way or another. So, you gotta put a bit of work in. I've, I've got, I got to like 23 people at some point and then tripped up and did something stupid. I forgot I left a corpse somewhere and they came back and some, when I was trying to murder someone else, they spotted the corpse. And it all ends unfortunate. Uh, Alright. Hey there, you wanna dance? I'm just dancing. Just dancing. Gotcha. Uh, I might need to murder her. Oh god. 
I'm just gonna get out of here, actually. Damn it, she didn't even see the fat guy. Oh, she saw the fat guy. Wasn't me. It was It was probably her. Look at her. The, you, you know, the one with the furs. I think that's furs. Is she wearing furs? She, she, she murdered the guy. It's totally her. She was hanging around that place. As guilty as anything. Police might actually arrest her as well, actually, to be fair. Maybe. I don't know. I've also seen them, like, arrest guys that are, like, asleep on the sofa, which is hilarious. It was like, yeah, yeah, the guy who's asleep on the sofa, yeah, he, he went on a rampage, killed, like, three people, and then passed out on the sofa nearby. Amazing what people will do under the influence of chemicals and drugs and things, you know. Oh. Yeah, he didn't see that. <laughs> guy had his back turned. This is cool. I mean, I'm enjoying this game immensely. I'm very much looking forward to the full thing. There's gonna be a bunch of different levels, different layouts of things. Uh, the procedural stuff is cool. It means you get a different experience each time, and just try trying to perfect things by murdering people in different ways is kind of cool. Uh, let's just get rid of you. I might get spotted there. Oh, she she's seen that. Well, me just having a dance. Okay. So who suspects me now? Well, I'm trying to do this well, and I've had a few goes at this before I started recording this. I had to try to trying to get things going well. Um, I usually try to prioritize the people who kind of suspect me. Uh, there's also if I hold left trigger, you can. There's kind of this audio thing. You can't move while you're holding left trigger, but you can sort of. I guess it shows a kind of radius around which people can hear you, or you can hear them, or I'm not really sure. I guess, I guess if there's people within audio range when you stab them, their suspicion will go up a bit. Because they heard something something untoward go down. Although you thought that guy in the yellow shirt on the sofa here would probably have a bit of suspicion. The amount of people who been murdered right next to him. Oh no, woman in the red shirt, please don't follow me up here. Don't, don't, where, where are you going? I could probably, I could probably get away with this one. Maybe. Do you think I could get it? I, I might. No, the, the, the redhead dude's coming. He, he would see that. Ruining everything. Dude in the shorts. Does anyone around here suspect me? Oh god, there's far too many people here. This is no good to me. No. No, sorry. I dig the music in this as well. In spite of being the kind of person who would be rather annoyed by a party like this, being extraordinary, and I would totally want to go and murder everyone, I'm kind of digging the music. Uh, I do feel they're very much missing a trick by not having some sort of partnership licensing of some sort with Andrew WK. Come on, the game is freaking called Party Hard. They need to be working with Andrew WK on this, this thing, really. Seriously. Anyone was made to work on the soundtrack for this game, that was the man. Uh, no, he's- no, you live today, sir. You're safe. Hey, you gonna go stand out of the way somewhere? Go get yourself killed? There are those notes you can read, but they literally just have the Party Hard logo on them, so I'm not sure what point they serve. In the Game Jam one, it had, like, newspaper cuttings, I believe, and you could see... bits of things about stuff, so I can- oh yeah. Oh no, it's not, it's Daily News, and it has a picture of... What suspiciously looks like me, and I'm not sure why. Not me, me, the character me. I mean, not me personally. The devs didn't go, oh, let's just get a photo of Maroka and do a pixel art version of him. That would be creepy. Very, very creepy. Um, you in the white shirt, do you want to let me murder Speedo over here? Speedo needs to die. Yeah, I'm just going to murder him while the police are kind of landing. Uh, waiter must die. Oh, shoot! They saw me. Oh, what? Yeah, there's like one line of sight there that I always cut. That one's tripped me up a couple of times. I can, while someone's going up the stairs, I can murder them next to the stairs, someone else next to the stairs, but there's like that one weird line of sight there that they can see you down below the balcony. Ah. And you get scored based on how many people you killed. And it just seems we have like a flat rate of 40 points per stab, so. I don't know. I don't know if more creative kills later on get you more points. I hope so. That would be good to see if you actually managed to do things more more elaborately. Or, I don't know, like chain chain kills, combo kills, double kill, multi-kill, get more points for those. It just seems to be like 40 points per kill right now. But... If, if that's simply the case, then your score is just literally a measure of how many people you've murdered, not how well you've murdered any of them. Which is a little disappointing, but... Like I say, 
It's, a, it's an early build. It's just kind of one level to show you the show you the things. I can, in fact, pick up corpses in this, but I found very little use for this. Uh, you move pretty slowly, and you have a really hard time putting down the bodies. God damn it! I, I can't do anything with this now. As uh, some cases, I've managed to put them down on the sofas and stuff. Seems to be a very limited number of places where you can put it. You can stab the corpse a few times. Yeah, get stabbed. Um, you can have a bit of a dance with the body. Hi, 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 hi. This can't end well. This can't end. Yeah. I don't know how you put down a body. I really don't. Oh, uh, I put it down when the police came to arrest me. Well, that's not going to go well, is it? Oh, dear. Yeah. So, there seems to be some sort of corpse moving, maybe even hiding mechanic. Can we go a bit, kind of, uh... Hitman or Metal Gear? Could you hide people? I think you must. I think you could hide people in closets in Metal Gear. Um, maybe even Sticks Master of Shadows. You could do that in that. Uh, most of your stealthy kind of games, things that involve killing people and hiding their bodies silently, those kind of things. They usually let you hide bodies somewhere. It'd be nice if there were a few places to stash corpses in this. I will say. Uh, in terms of traps and things, I've seen one guy sort of hanging off the side, back of the roof here. I really, really, really want to be able to push him off the roof, I will say. If there's a guy there, it's like, please, just can I just give him a shove? Just a bit of a nudge, just backwards over the top of the roof. He's hanging off the edge of a building, come on. Uh, I'm a terrible person. I am a really terrible person. But we all are when we play party hard, apparently. Uh, somebody is seeing some stuff. Well, these guys can get stabbed. Oh, what? Did someone see that? I, I guess the guy the guy with the open shirt there, he must have seen me. Uh, it's so easy to screw up. But this is cool, it's really... I don't know, there's something really addictive about this. Now, I'm not at liberty to share this version with you, I'm afraid. Uh, however, I will, probably in the description below, link the original Game Jam version, which is... To be quite honest, pretty buggy. But it's much the same concept. It's it's less pretty pixel art. It's a little more basic pixel art, and but it's got it actually does have more of the mechanics in place. So it, it very much gives you a feel for the game, and you can check it out and try it and try and murder all the peoples. Uh, because the police are not very intelligent in that, like at all. It's actually surprisingly easy to murder all the people, much more so than in something like this. However, in that version, waving your knife around gets people's attention. Around here, I can, to the best of my knowledge, I can just sort of... I can just slash at thin air with my knife, and... Oh god, he's seen the corpse! No. What?! Oh, they, they, they suspected me. Because I, probably because I was running, quickly running away from this crime scene. I should have, I should have gone down the water slide. I should have gone down the water slide. Just generally in life, I should always have gone down the water slide. Oh well. Hey, this is party hard. I am super excited to play this game when it comes out. Uh, I think it's due out later this year. I, don't quote me on that though. Um, but this is really cool. I'm enjoying this a lot. Yay! Thank you very much for watching. I've been Maroka. This has been Party Hard. I'll see you next time.